victory, your victory is domiciled in your tongue. Your victory against the devil, victory over sin is domiciled in your tongue. Everything sitting on you must fall off today. And I decree that your tongue be loosed. Be healed of spiritual dumbness. In the name of Jesus Christ. They went forth and preached everywhere and God was working with them, confirming their word with signs following. What you are afraid to declare, God cannot confirm. What you can't declare boldly, God cannot confirm openly. Open your mouth wide and I will fill it. Is somebody blessed? Therefore, I decree every spiritual dumbness healed today. At a point, Peter was possessed by a devil and he took up Jesus and began to rebuke him. And Jesus turned back and said, Get thee behind me, Satan. And that devil just left. And Peter became normal again. It was, you have just declared him as the Lord and Christ in verse 18. You can't be rebuking him in verse 23. Matthew 16, 23. Yeah, he said, neither flesh nor blood has revealed this to you. Eh? And upon this, I'll build my rock. Oh, Satan said we would get him out. And Satan overwhelmed Peter. And he took Jesus and began to rebuke him. Jesus said, Satan, get him behind me. And Peter was free. It's time for you and I to say to those stubborn issues, get him behind me, Satan, in the name of Jesus Christ. Get thee behind me, Satan, in the name of Jesus Christ. I don't know what that thing is right now where you are seated. Get thee behind me in the name of Jesus. Spirit of slumber, get thee behind me in the name of Jesus. Spirit of wardom, get thee behind me in the name of Jesus. Spirit of disobedience, get thee behind me in the name of Jesus. What you don't resist has a right to remain. Resist the devil and it will flee from you. Resist sin and it will flee from you. James chapter 4 verse 7. Give no place to the devil and will take all the place. Ephesians 4 27. Jesus resisted Satan by the word from his mouth. What was he saying? It is written. Man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that Proceeds out of the mouth of God. It is written, Thou shalt not tempt the Lord your God. It is written, Thou shalt worship the Lord, Him only shalt thou serve. And Satan left him. Amen. I give you a mouth and what? And wisdom. And God's word is God's wisdom. So we engage the word of God with our tongue. To clear the devil of our lives. Can I hear your amen? Yeah. 